PO box. And I just want to show you guys right now, I'm placing the package down. I am locking the door. I'd say for the weight of this box, it's quite moderate. It's not really heavy. It's not the heaviest package I've gotten off the dark web, but I'm gonna do what I always do. Showing you guys the sides of the boxes. Nice clean box over here, red tape. This is what the top of the box looks like. But anyways, guys, I'll see you guys at the end of the video. Let's get this show started. All right, so this month's color we are using red. Nice bright red gloves. Some of you guys are gonna remember this over here. Hope I'm not damaging anything inside. Wow, talk about nicely sealed. Oh my God. All right. So starting off this box. Oh boy. All right, me talking to you guys right now, this is all after I recorded the unboxing and I can tell you guys right now that I'm still pretty shaken up by the experience. It's the most messed up mystery box I've ever received. I think I'm gonna get some nightmares for the next coming weeks, months, years. Um, didn't think it's something I'd ever see in my life, but I seen it and I unboxed it. It changed me completely. I am a 23 year old man and I am not the same person anymore. But um, anyways, stay tuned for the rest of the video. Already we have some pretty bad implications just looking in the inside for the first few seconds. Yeah, let's get started top to bottom. First thing we're gonna pull out of the box over here. Well, this doesn't implicate anything good. Oh boy, a bank robber mask. I mean, this is like the worst bank robber mask ever. It's supposed to be like two eyes open, open you know, but this is like a whole face. <laughs> you can get a pure identification with this thing, but I don't like the implication. Um, anything that goes to my right, it's gonna be trash. Anything that goes to my left is gonna be kept with value. You guys know the rules. I see no value in this whatsoever, so it's gonna go to the trash. Next thing we're gonna pull out is a little, oh, a mirror. Okay, I look pretty good for the video. I think so. I'm not feeling conceited, but uh, we have a little mirror over here just to show you guys what it looks like up close. Huh, interesting. This is like something you see in one of those children movies, like a talking mirror, you know, a talking mirror or something. I don't know, it looks pretty nice. I'll put it to the value side just because I don't know what it is, you know. Oh boy. Something else to implicate a really bad behavior. Black leather gloves. A black mask and black leather gloves. I see no value in this stuff, but we're gonna put it to the side. We're not gonna throw it away yet. I'm gonna let you know right now, throughout this video, you are gonna have hundreds of questions. Before you continue watching the video, press pause right now. Go follow me on Twitter, at CryptoNWO with a K. And I'm gonna be retweeting people who kinda have theories on this, and I'm gonna be retweeting people who are messaging me, and I'm gonna be kinda posting my own theories. So again, go ahead and follow me on Twitter, at CryptoNWO with a K. Every mystery box has meaning, you know what I mean? So we have, it's like a glass porcelain mask. Take a look at this. It's pretty, it's nice. I don't know what else to think about it. It's a nice little mask. <laughs> does it suit me or does it suit my personality? I wouldn't think so. Am I gonna put it on? <laughs> Triggered people in the comment section down below. There's anthrax inside the mask. Next thing we have here is a pair of sunglasses. Woman sunglasses. <laughs> we got a pair of uh, woman sunglasses over here. Is it bad that I look pretty fire in a pair of woman glasses? The more you look at the things that come out of this box over here, the more you realize it's implicating something really, really bad. We're just gonna... What the hell? Okay, from the angle I'm sitting at right now, and I just, I, like, I, I don't wanna move any cameras and ruin it, but from the angle I'm sitting at, I can't see. Like, you guys can see right now with this camera pointing into the box, but there is a freaking scope in here. <laughs> Not a well-functioning one. Probably. Oh, wow, okay. Uh, take a look at this over here. Oh, dear Lord. A scope. How much do these things go for? If anybody knows how much these go for, just let me know in the comment section down below because, wow. Huh. Interesting find. I'm putting this to my left. I mean, I'm not gonna be using it for anything. I'm definitely like, the stuff that I keep of value, I sell it, I resell it to make my money back and then buy more mystery boxes, upload it on YouTube, resell the stuff that I don't need. And then just basically it's a loop that goes on and on. Hopefully goes on and on. Next thing we have is a file. Now. Looks like we're halfway into the box already, so yeah, we'll open the files. All right, the next thing we have in here is a 
The inside of the file over here says how many licks. I don't even want to know what that means. Let's put this to my right. I see no value. Whoa! Ho oh, ho! We got some cash here. 20, 40, 60, 80, 120, 40, 60. 160 dollars US. Just checking to see if it's real. We got a nice bright light over here. It looks pretty real to me. I'm just gonna feel the money with my fingers, so. That feels like real money if you ask me. But other than that, we have quite a few things in here. So we have a bookstore weekly schedule. We have a bunch of people's names and the time they work. That's a little weird if you ask me, but I'm trying to put two and two together. I can't. So we have cash, we have a mirror, we have a mask. We have this scope over here. We have some gloves, sunglasses that look like they belong to a woman, a file that contained a bunch of papers that we're gonna go through in just a minute. Now it's time to tidy up a little bit. Getting a little claustrophobic. He's strong, nice smell coming out of this box. A really flowery smell, vanilla smell. Um, push all this stuff to the side. We have a weird schedule over here, which I see no value of whatsoever. I have no idea what this is. If you guys know what this is, just let me know in the comment section down below. But you know, to me, I'm at a complete loss right now. Looks like a string. A map right here um, with an X that points towards the map and Apomatox, Apomatix, Apomatox, Bucky, Buckin, State Forest. I have no idea where this is or what this is. I really hate maps only because they leave a really small portion of the map and I have, you know, but that's why you guys come in, you know, you guys are the detectives, you guys are smarter than I am. Uh, just figure out where this stuff is. Let me know where this stuff is in the comment section down below. Obviously figure out the places that are on the map, but please, I don't condone anybody going to these locations. There were a couple of YouTubers who went to one of the locations that were on the maps in one of my previous videos, but again, just please don't go to this location. I don't recommend it at all. I don't condone it. Just figure out where it is and everybody stay away from it. Thank you. All right, so next we have this thing over here. I have no idea what this is. Um, the heck? Oh, these are charcoals coming from a Middle Eastern culture. Um, I definitely know what these are. Um, shisha, argila, hookah. I made a mess on my table. See no value in it whatsoever. Next we have... It's really... This is, this is probably what's making the box pretty heavy. Look at this. Like that. <laughs> no bounce whatsoever. If you guys know what this is over here, just let me know. Put it in the comment section down below. Um, I'm at a loss for words right now. It's like a rock. I'll put some b-roll footage on the screen for you guys just so you can take a look at it yourselves. I have no idea what this is. Put it to my left because I have no idea what I'm looking at. Maybe it could be valuable, maybe not. I'm sorry about the really bad exposure on this camera, guys. Um, I don't have it set up properly. I'm in the middle of the unboxing and I really don't want to fix the camera settings, but like right now the exposure is all messed up on my face. But opening this little thing inside, we have a little pair of... Wow. Look at these. Take a look at these pair of really old binoculars right here. Whoa, these are old. If you know what year these babies come from, just let me know in the comment section down below. But this is like really, really, really old. Look at the inside of the case. Nice and red. Oh, these really suck. <laughs> I probably have to adjust everything, but... Oh, there we go. Whoa. Ooh. Okay, I'm looking at my window curtain right now and I can see really fine detail. Oh my goodness. These are really nice. These are definitely valuable. I'm keeping these. Uh, the next thing we're gonna pull out of the box, an air freshener. This is, this is what's having the box smelling like absolute flowers. There's nothing else in this box that has a bad smell for this to mask it, but to be 100% honest, uh, this smells really nice. Put it in my car. <laughs> Dark web air freshener in the car. Put it to my left. Next thing we have is a thanks card. I don't know what a thanks card is, but um, you're welcome. <laughs> Next, inside the box, we have a picture frame. Not interesting at all. It's a heavy picture frame. It's a thick picture frame. Oh, okay, look at this. It's taped up. And it's like two inches thick. Oh my goodness, okay. Oh boy. Don't be anything bad. Don't let it be anything I have to blur out on the screen. Come on. All right. 
This part of the video, I need you guys to put on your detective caps. This is where everything starts putting itself together. Now, I'm starting to pick everything apart myself, but I need you guys, the detectives, the people that are smarter than me, I need you guys to start picking it apart. Put it in the comment section down below. Let me know and let everybody else know what's going on. Moment of truth. Oh. We have an SD card. Take a look at that. It's like in a, it's like floating in a little container over here. That's pretty cool. I like that. But it's an SD card, guys. Wait till the end of the video and we'll be going through this. Uh, putting it to my left, somewhere I can access it. And next we have... In the, the picture that's inside the picture frame, take a look at the picture. I'll put pictures up on the screen for you guys, but take a look at the picture right now that's inside this frame. On the back of it, it says T U T one one four three, and it's just framed. And you know, look at that. Uh, but there's a whole bunch of other pictures here, and I'm gonna be putting them up on the screen for you guys. So we have a guy walking with a gray T-shirt, beige T-shirt. I can't really see in this lighting, and a black backpack. On the back, it says V I N six six seven. I don't know what that means. The same guy. On the back, it says M E L zero six eight. Again, the same guy. It literally says Z, or yeah, like Z, and then one one or I I. The same guy. What the heck is going on? It says P E Z. 81110 Okay, different people a family or a group of friends somebody with a baby maybe yeah L O 010 and then a really cropped up picture somebody crossing the street and somebody with a blue bag What is going on here? Whoa, this is the guy from before D F L 116 same guy from before, MM001. Why does everybody have a bag on? Or why is everybody holding something? That's the big question. XL316, OW376, and then this is, this is a picture of that same guy holding that. What is that? The guy crossing the street again, brown bag. On the back it says HK question mark one eight. This one here again, the guy crossing the street. D A C one eight one. Yo, I that's creepy. And then let's take a look at this picture. On the inside it says hit twice. Brown bag. What the hell? Hit twice, brown bag. Okay, in this picture over here, again, the guy with the brown bag. Oh, that's weird. <laughs> that's really weird. Somebody just walking around the city and just taking pictures of people holding bags. Or maybe that was intentional. I have no idea who these people are and I don't want to know who these people are and I don't want to know what these letters represent. Oh dear lord. Okay. Oh. So that little plate I took off the back of this, um, this is what it looks like over here. I don't know if that's a message you guys can decode. Just let me know exactly what this stuff is like decoded to because I have no clue. Take a look at that little thing too. Let me know what this symbolizes over here. I'm at a loss for words right now. I have absolutely no idea. We're going to put it all to my left because this could be used as evidence. Wow. That's absolutely crazy, huh? Why is there tape everywhere? It looks like somebody broke a cross or something. I have no idea why they would do this, but... Again, people trying to be creepy on the dark web. I like it. Looks pretty nice, if you ask me. Uh, is it valuable to me? Sure. The last thing we have inside this box, it's kind of squishy. What is... Ew. Ew! Ew! Ew, what is that? Oh my god, is that a tongue? What the f***? What the f***? Oh, that's... No, that's bad. 
No, 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 that's not good. That's the line right there. That's where you, that's where you phone the police. This over here is where you draw the line over here. Oh, this is not good. My phone just died on me. No. Oh, that's not good. Uh, okay, I'm gonna go charge my phone. I'm gonna go phone the cops. I'm just gonna remain a little calm because I have to calm down. Before I call the police, I really wanna check the files in the SD card really quickly because I have no idea what's going on. I kinda wanna catch up with everything. I'm literally at a loss for words right now and I have no idea what's going on. So I'm gonna check the files in the SD card. We're gonna phone the cops and we're gonna take care of this. We're gonna do it calmly, calm down. This is bad. So far, what I'm putting together is scope, dark gloves, dark mask, somebody's sunglasses. Oh, this is not good. Oh, this is not good at all. Yeah, I know. Um, all right, guys, time to go through the files in the SD card. Yeah. 